Hey guys, uh, today I've got a tutorial for you on how to have a custom domain as your Minecraft server IP. Now if you look at most professional Minecraft servers, ours included, not that it's a major massive server, but we try to make it as professional as possible. With a lot of big servers, they don't have a number IP, you'll notice that. It'll be, you know, whatever the server's called, dot um, .mc.net or whatever their host is. Now, uh, usually you have to pay for those kind of things to make it look professional, but the, work, the, what, the, the thing we do is we use a website called No IP, and this is how you can have your own um, worded IP for your Minecraft server. Anyone can do this completely free, and it's very useful because um, if your IP changes, which it can do if you connect to somebody's el somebody else's internet connection, um, you don't have to go around telling everyone that plays on your server the new, the new IP. You can just change it within the config on the website, and people can just use the same word IP. So. Basically, you want to come to www.noip.com. I'll leave a link in the description, obviously, and then you want to click on the sign in button or sign up button, um, it, depending on whether you already have an account. I'm guessing, since you're watching this video, you don't. So you want to click on the sign up button and go for all the details, which isn't very hard. You just have to put an email in. Uh, I, think, I can't remember. I think you have to com confirm the email and then you just put your name in, and uh, that's pretty much it. So I'm going to sign in and show you what the uh, the menu looks like after you've signed in. Okay, so once you've signed in and you've set up your account, um, you'll be confronted with this page, and uh, it'll say hello, um, your name, and then you'll get these um, five options here: manage domains, add domain, refer friend, add host, manage host. Now, the first thing you pretty much want to do is click on manage hosts, and you should come on to this site um, page here, and these will be all your kind of um, redirected hosts. So it'll be the IP that you're redirecting to the host. So um, obviously that is our server IP. I've hidden my IP because I don't want you guys hacking me or anything. Um, not that you would, but uh, yeah, I've just hidden it for safety. Um, so yeah, these will be all the ones you've made. Now to actually make one you need to click on add host. So let's just do that now. Okay, so once you've selected to add a new host, um, this is the page you'll get. So you'll have host name information. You don't need to bother about any of the mail options. Um, just worry about the host host name information. Okay, so host name that's pretty much what's the the main part of your IP. So you could have whatever you, ju you could just put whatever the name of your Minecraft server is. So we could put Epic Server, uh, and then this is the thing that's next to it. Um, so dot no IP dot oh that's what we currently use. But there's lots of different games down here. So there's Quake. Um, these are just some random ones. We've got Half Life, Serve Game. Serve Counter Strike, some of these, you know, and then there's obviously the paid ones up here, which are a little better, but it doesn't really matter. There's not really a point in getting a paid account on this. If you do get a paid account, though, you can have more than three host domains because on a free account, you can only have um, three host domains. So, yeah, that depending on how many servers are what you have and stuff like that. Um, then the host type, leave that alone. Don't touch that. Um, DNS host is fine, and then your IP address. To get your IP address. You go on Google and you type in what's my IP. The top one will tell you your public IP, and you want to put that in there. Make sure it is your public IP, and uh, yeah. And uh, when you first come on here, your current IP will automatically go into there, so you don't have to do anything, anything then. But if your IP ever changes and um, you know your server's on, but it isn't showing up on Minecraft, then make sure to double check that. Yeah, um, just type in what's my IP on Google. It'll tell you your new IP, and then just change it. And uh, yeah, it'll be that. That's pretty much it. And uh, yeah, so I'll just show you what it will look like if you need to change your IP. If you need to change your IP, this is what it will look like. Obviously, you'll have your host domain at the top. Um, you can change the host type, but as I said before, just leave it like that. And then your IP address that you currently have, that uh, you're currently using, will be in the IP address bar. And uh, you just need to put your new one in. And uh, yeah, it's as simple as that. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment. I'll be happy to answer any. And uh, yeah, this is very something very simple to do. It is recommended that you port forward if you're going to do this because Hamachi servers, uh, they're not as good um, because you don't have professional Hamachi servers. They're all port forwarded or you know hosted professionally. So yeah, if you have any questions, obviously leave a comment. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.